Hello, everybody. Good morning. Uh, this is take five, six, seven already <laughs> this morning. It's too early and very gloomy outside. We've been getting a lot of rain lately, so today is supposed to be uh, a dry day. At least no rain, but the clouds is hovering still over us. And then tomorrow we'll get some more. So anyways, uh, for those of you who are still with me, I hope you guys are doing the project along with me. I love to hear um, what you're doing, share some picture, what it's looked like, how things is coming along with your project. If you're working with, if you're um, sewing with me and... Uh, so as you can see, there's some changes that I did. Something else happened while I'm doing this last week. And um, I decided to get rid of my excess DMC floss. And this is the great way to get rid of them. You guys, I have a lot of them. And I know if you're um, do embroidery, you know, you love to sew, you probably have some leftover DMC floss like I do here. Little things, they're so tiny, there's not enough to do anything for a project, right? So, and, and I have a bunch more over here. I and look. Great, great way to get rid of them. I got rid of a few already, right? I decided I'm going to embellish the project. As you can see, I've done some feather stitching. And then I also put some French knot in each stitch. So it kind of looked like a vine with little rosette on the on each branch so that's what I did and I just I try to go light uh, with whatever I have left over but you know anything goes anything goes anything you want to use it's your wallet you you go with it go with it so I thought about putting some chain stitching on the horizontal because pretty much I did the vertical except this one I went completely around it. But I thought of doing some um, chain stitching vertically and uh, I attempted and it just didn't look right to me. So I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to leave it as is. And um, so next video we're going to cut this to size and then put it together. So I just want to bring you along and share. Um, I think it's a great tip to get rid of your floss. So I, that's what I did. Oh, and I also did this. I, I went ahead and did some back and forth, back and forth running stitch um, on this way and then this way. I don't, oh, you, I don't know if you can tell. So it kind of really... Um, brought in that that section a little bit more and lighten it up a little bit more in that in that blue um frame there so it, it it's it's like this but look how how it kind of popped a little bit more so um so yeah that's where we're at and then another thing i wanted to share with you guys is if you if you do videos like I do if you record your crafting and you struggle with the setup with your tripod I have a tripod it's just so big so tall sometimes it doesn't quite get the the, the image the direction that I want it to go uh, I know this the setup right now I have you guys are looking in on the sideways I believe that's what it looks like I suppose I could rotate my my uh, my video but it wouldn't look right for you guys so I'm always sitting this way right so so and you're like viewing from this side from my right anyways just a hat that I, I found if you have a zocone stand it's a perfect tripod 
for for your work desk. Oh, it just makes my recording such a breeze, you guys. I have the little um, small hoop set up on it. The lens on my camera goes right through that hoop, and then the camera sits on top of it. I'm going to insert the picture. Um, if you have the Zocone embroidery stand, give it a try. Anyways, um, I thought I'd share that with you, and I will just go ahead and insert a few pictures in the end so you guys know what I'm talking about. I'm just going to excuse the mess in the background. <laughs> That's it, you guys. I just wanted to share you with this. Next video, I promise we're going to go ahead and finish this project up and uh, turn it into a beautiful wallet. Okay? So, all right. I will talk to you guys again really soon. Thank you again for all, all of you that um, watched the last video and all the likes. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. And... Uh, with that, I bid you a wonderful day, a wonderful week, and a great weekend. And I will chat with you again really soon. Take care. Bye.